It's not a wildcat scheme. It's a magnificent, undreamed-of little village. I've named it Nolan Heights. It's almost finished, but I ran out of cash. Oh, please, my boy, don't let them take it away from me. Mr. Nolan. Here I am, Mr. Nolan. All right, I'll take it. What? A letter. Uh-huh. Read it. This will introduce a graduate of Pitt and the Beaux-Arts, a young architect of broad vision and fine artistic background. I heartily recommend her to you for your fine project, Nolan Heights. With kindest personal regards, I am sincerely V. Travis. Who is V. Travis? That's me. The V is for Virginia. Well, who is this remarkable young architect? Oh, that's me too. Well, B.J., we've got a lot of work to do. This place is a shambles. Come on, help me get these covers off. Now listen, Virginia. Well, you see, we're getting along fine. You call me Virginia. Now wait, I don't want to be an old crud, but who do you think you're fooling? My son knows I'm busted. He'll catch on the minute he sees me. He's no dumbbell even if he is my son. But he isn't going to see you. He's going to see me. What's that? Don't worry, B.J. I want to be an architect, but not that bad. Where am I going to be? In Chicago, arranging a big deal. Only really, you'll be here hiding. Of course, he'll believe you. Well, he won't lend you the money anyway, as long as he knows you want it. So, you must make him think you don't want it. If you were a woman, you'd know that. I thought you had a man's mind. Of course, but I think like a woman when I have to. B.J., this is as near to a real job as I've been in years. The only thing that stands in our way is a conservative young man. Besides, what can you lose? Okay, we'll take that kid over to Hoyle's. Complaining. I'm going to marry that boy so that you and I can live happily ever afterward. Uncle Henri. But I am not your uncle, and I love you. I told you I'd leave him as soon as he marries me. If I can ever get him to propose. Holy mackerel, what a way to make a living. You know any other way to make a living? Oh, this whole business gives me the woolies. 